Welcome to 2K Sports for another edition of NBA Basketball. With David Aldridge on our sideline and here with me, Greg Anthony and Steve Smith, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll see the New York Knicks and the Philadelphia 76ers. So the New York starting five, Anthony is out there with Reed. Then it's Ewing. Then there's Frazier. And it's Houston at the two-guard spot. Now Frazier after the missed three from Allen Iverson. Frazier the pass to Ewing. Now Reed guarded by Chamberlain. Down low. And Ewing slams it in. Now flying high and throwing it down with the one hand. Woo, one of his favorite moves right there, guys. Now here's Iverson. Embiid with it. Poked away. Stolen by Ewing. Here's Houston. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. And Houston, a, a pro at initiating the contact. An aggressive shooter who's looking for opportunities to get to the line. The next shoot their first free throws tonight. The first trip to the stripe in this one. And he makes the first. He hits both from the strike. We've seen him put a lot of pressure on the defense and then cash in at the line. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. And looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. And, guys, point of emphasis for the league is to really crack down on illegal screens. Yes, the last few years, the rules changes have tended to benefit the offenses. This evens things out a bit. Here's Houston. Knocked away. the wing Ewing just four to shoot and here's Anthony for three a rebound by Will Chamberlain great perimeter D gave a good shooter absolutely no room to operate good and the assist goes to Irving but, but here's the problem now, no one's got the strength to move Will off the spot and no one has the height to challenge the shot at its point of release now here's Frazier Here's Ewing. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That one on MB. New York shooting their third and fourth free throw shot to the night. Good from Ewing. Cheeks checked in for Philadelphia. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Because he knows he makes a living at the line, he invites contact and sometimes even initiates it. Shot Barkley. Frazier against Iverson. To the middle. Here's Chamberlain, and he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Second team foul. At the line for your Sixers, Will Chamberlain. What's up?
And that one misses. And Anthony's got the ball here for New York. Pass to Frazier. Back to Anthony. Frazier against Iverson. And Frazier with the basket on the assist by Anthony. And people think of Anthony purely as a shooter, but the guy can make the slick pass when the opportunity presents itself. Now, here is Barkley. The shot, no good. Some solid defense from Reed. Frazier dishes to Anthony. Pass to Ewing. And it's blocked! And he keeps control of the ball! Now Iverson. Outside Irving. Good! And it's Iverson who picks up the assist. He just sees everything on the floor. Nice vision from Iverson to find the open man. It's tipped. Anthony with it. He's picked up by Irving. Anthony, the pass to Houston. Rebounded by Wilt Chamberlain. 76ers trailing. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. Cheeks kicks to Iverson. Cheeks against Ewing. Five on the clock. Chamberlain with a screen on Ewing. Cheeks. A miss that time. Would have put him up. It can be a little disheartening when you do everything right and come away with nothing. And Anthony gets it to go. This is where Carmelo's teammates look to feed him. The mid-range, he has that down peg. Iverson passes to Irving. Goes back up. He takes it up and lays it in. Irving's got five. Relentless on the offensive glass, and then you love the finish. The pass to Ewing. Shoots over Chamberlain. Ewing can't get it to go. I like it. That's a great battle at the rim. He just couldn't finish. And it's Iverson missing. And so it's Anthony bringing it up for the New York Knicks. Inside. And the dunk by Reed. Explosive leaping ability allows him to play the five, even though he's a little undersized. And here is Iverson. Nothing on the board. This is it to Chamberlain. Iverson against Frazier. It's stolen by Frazier. Kicks to Anthony. Pass to Houston. Lock at six. Stolen by Cheeks. Frazier against Irving. Another miss by Philadelphia. New York leading by three. Anthony drives in. And stolen by Chamberlain. Three on three. Here's Iverson. He can't get it to go. Some solid defense from Reed. Anthony taking his time here. Frazier. That's in there. Anthony with the assist. Frazier's got his second basket of the game. Savvy play by Carmelo. He knows the defense expects him to time fire, out, so he out. makes a pass to an open teammate. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here.
making a switch here. Monroe's checked in. And against Frazier. It's stolen by Frazier. Anthony with the screen on Iverson. Ewing finds Anthony. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Through the years, Carmelo Anthony has remained consistent. Still knocking down shots and making it look easy. It's his first trip to the line. Taking two shots. First free throw is good. And Philadelphia making a change here. Cunningham's checked in. Free throws, good from Anthony. So it's Philadelphia now. Seven-point differential. Chamberlain with a screen on Monroe. Here's Cheeks. It's deflected, and he recovers it. Barkley outside. Pass to Iverson from past the arc. It's hauled in by Ewing. Ewing's got his fourth rebound in this one. And at a certain point, you just have to look to someone else to score for you. Here's Anthony. Softly drops in the floater. Anthony. Anthony's got six. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Knocks it loose. Taken away by Anthony. The pass to Frazier. Whoops, anticipated the pass. Turnover. He lobs it up. Stolen by Ewing. Poke loose. Reed against Barkley. The dish to Iverson. Shoots over Frazier. And they recover it. And again, Philadelphia turns it over. Malone's check in for Barkley. Substitution on the court. So it's Monroe with it, bringing it up for New York. They have a nine-point lead. Here's the floater, and it's good on the way in. Defensively, they've got to pick up the intensity. Hard to win, surrendering this high a field goal percentage. And the 76ers call time here.
The 76ers trail by 11. Iverson outside. Chamberlain kicks to Iverson. Chamberlain a screen. Iverson passes to Chamberlain. And it's Chamberlain finishing it off. And that's just too easy. The size, strength, length. No way to stop Chamberlain once he gets the ball in that close. Monroe finds Ewing. And that's collected by Malone. And all quarter long, it's been the same story. Inconsistent with this offense. Passes it to Chamberlain. Not loose. Here's Garen. Still without a basket. On the wing, Ewing. And Patrick Ewing with the slam. And Ewing with that size really creates a tough matchup, especially when he's attacking the offensive board. And play stop. Whistle on what looks to be an illegal screen. Yeah, and that has been a huge problem for them here early in this game. And not the most common call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. It's often a tough call that can go either way, but I agree with you on that one. Now, here's Ewing. He's got six. A shot by Frazier, no good. I'll tell you what, I think he thought that was going in. I sure did. Cheeks' shot is good. And guarding him on the perimeter isn't a priority for them right now, but if this continues, it will be. Frazier the pass to Ewing. Back to Frazier. Monroe outside. Pass to King. Down to five on the shot clock. Looking for Ewing. He gets it there. Beat the shot clock, but it's off the mark. Meeting right at the rim. He typically converts in those situations. Not this time. Cheeks against Monroe. Cunningham outside. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. And Cunningham is an elite offensive player, a guy who can score in bunches and does a little bit of everything for his team. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The hustle stats for New York. The way they've been going after steals in this game, it has been super impressive. They are wreaking havoc right now. And how about also the ability to contest shots? They're staying attached and contesting and coming away with blocks as well. Stoudemire, he's checked in for New York. So Cunningham nails both of them. And there's a minute 45 left here in the first quarter. Monroe outside. With the teardrop. And it's good. Two points. Monroe's got his second basket of the night. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. Pass to Chamberlain. Cunningham on the wing. There's the pass to Greer. No good with the triple. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. Monroe the pass to Stottom. Malone with the block. How about the quicks there by Malone to get up and deter that shot, utilizing that size and reach for the rejection. Now, here's Cheeks. Here's Cunningham. The pass to good off the assist from Cheeks. New York leading by six. Stoudemire outside. DeBusher kicks to Frazier. There's 38 seconds left in the first. Here's Stoudemire, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. And this is where Stoudemire inflicts so much damage, and it's why he gets fouled so often. New York shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. The 
first one falls. Yeah, drawing fouls and making them pay at the line. So one for two that time with the strike. The 76ers trail by seven. 26 seconds left to play here in the first. Here's Cunningham. Oh, that's blocked. Now here is Monroe. To the paint, Malone with the steal. And so it's the New York Knicks heading to the bench with a seven-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. They have made it very tough to get a shot off against them. Their defense has been stifling. Back right after this. Side of game seven as this series comes to a head. And guys, what's your take on the Knicks so far? Stingy on the defensive end in that first quarter. They were just getting up into people. Yeah, they were very physical and very aggressive. They've just been the better team so far. Embiid is out there at Malone. Then it's Jones. And it's Cheeks. And it's Greer in at the two. That's the group in the game for the 76ers. Now, here's Cheeks. Passes to Malone. Over Frazier. It'll go, and the New York League is cut to just five points in the basket from Malone. And Malone, a high percentage score when he gets it in deep. Once he's got the defense on his back, the game becomes easy with his ability to score. Cheeks against Frazier. He kicks it to DeBusher. Stoudemire left side. It's over Embiid. That one's in his first bucket of the game. He's one for two. So it's Philadelphia now. Pass to Embiid. Malone in the post. The Bushers there. And on that shot, with that, the Nick lead is cut down to five there, thanks to the basket from Malone. Frazier with it. And Embiid with the block. And how about the anticipation from the big fella? Embiid is one of the league's premier shot blockers. That one falls. Embiid's got his first two points. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Got a piece of it. Here's Greer. Scoreless thus far. Frazier against Cheeks to the inside. Here's Embiid, and they call the foul, so he's got the and-one chance here to make it a three-point play. And you've got to admire the toughness that Embiid plays with. He doesn't let fouls stop him from scoring. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And Philadelphia making a change here. Collins has checked in. At the line for Philadelphia, Joel Embiid. One shot. One shot. And Embiid, no good on that one. Better than most centers from the line. Embiid, exceptional with his hand. Frazier scanning the floor. Here's Houston. 
Good. Great play set up by Frazier. Houston's got five points so far. If you relax on him out there, he's going to make you pay every time. Here's Greer. Launches a three. It's rebounded by DeBusher. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Here's Houston. They lead by four. Hits the three-point bomb. And this is where Houston is at his best. So good at just catching and shooting. Malone outside. Philadelphia moving the ball around. And that one good from Greer. Greer's got himself on the board with three there. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Now here's Stoudemire. Pass to Houston. Stoudemire with a screen on Collins. Sinks the three-pointer. 11 points in the game. The defense a step slow. You can see the result. Down low, here's Jones, and he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. The 76ers have gone two of four at the free throw line. Bobby Jones, two shots. Shoot two. And that one falls for Jones. Patrick Ewing's checked in for Stoudemire. And so Jones nails both of them. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Now Frazier, the three. Houston shots good. Houston's got 14. 12 straight points off of three-pointers, and the D looks shell shot. Up top, MB. Ewing defending. Malone. And it's Malone finishing it off. This is who you want leading that play. A sure passer with great awareness. Frazier the pass to Ewing. And there's the call on Joel Embiid. And that'll be his third foul so far. And that's the tough part of trying to keep him on the floor. Now he picks up that third foul. Collins checked in for the 76ers. King against Jones. And that one is good. King's got his first points of the game. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Collins passes to Embiid. Collins in the post. Embiid with a screen on Frazier. Nine feet out. And Ewing sends it back. And that's out of bounds. Philadelphia will retain possession. And we have to take another glance at that powerful rejection. And that block was something. It's the playoffs. And every possession and defensive stop matters. Some changes for Philadelphia. Malone's checked in for Embiid. Irving comes in for Collins. And Iverson's subbed in for Cheeks. Four on the shot clock. It's good from long range. Iverson's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. And it's encouraging seeing Iverson just bury the three ball. When he's got that shot going, he is basically unguardable. Now, here is DeBush. No scoring in this one. That shot wide open. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five mates are from beyond the arc. Here's Iverson, and there's the pass to Bark. The feed to Malone. And it's Malone finishing it off. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. 
Pass to Ewing. To Busher with it. Pass to Houston. And it's off from three-point range. The 76ers trail by six. And here's Jones. And Malone gets it to go on the assist by Jones. Malone's got 10 points in the game. Trying to slice into this deficit every time up the floor. Terrific quarter for him. Outside Irving. It's rebounded by New York. Doesn't register as a block, but he did everything you want defending that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well and did a good job of contesting without committing the foul. A nice shot by Frazier. Frazier. Frazier's got his third basket of the night. And the combination of his quickness and soft touch around the rim really allows him to pull off shots like that. A lot of players don't have the reverse in their arsenal. Iverson passes to Barkley. Back to Iverson. Fires from deep. It's rebounded by Ewing. Ewing's got rebound number seven for him tonight. They keep calling his number, which is partly how they've dug this hole. Now, here is DeBush. Still scoreless. Here's Houston. Off target from three-point range. And so it's Jones. He'll bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. They trail by six. Now, here's Iverson. Pass to Barton. Wants to get it to Malone and does. And it's Malone finishing it off. And, and just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. And the Knicks decide to take their first time out here. Well, it's a player's league, but certainly coaching has its place. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. Chamberlain's checked in for Philadelphia. So it's New York with it. Four-point game. Out of bounds. Philadelphia takes possession. Sixers ball. Irving with the ball. Five points in the game. This is to Malone. Up top, Chamberlain. Reed covering, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. No question, he got bumped on that shot. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. At the line for your Sixers, Luke Chamberlain. Two shots. Shoot two. And the first one at the line is good.
And Chamberlain hits them both. Here's Richardson. And the pass to Guerin. Some nice passing by New York here. Malone with the block. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. Back to Iverson. The shot goes down and it gets this game back to even. Iverson's got five points in the quarter. Oh, nice stroke on Iverson's jumper. He looks so confident taking that shot. Ewing, a screen on Iverson. Kicks it out to Richardson. Here's Houston. Knocks down the three ball. Houston. Houston's got 20 three points. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Passes it to Iverson. And here's Chamberlain. They double team Chamberlain. The kick out to Irving. Six on the shot clock from 20 feet out. Bank shot, no good. New York leading by three. Richardson outside. Pass to Ewing. Good work defensively by Malone. Now the 76ers with it. Barkley dishes to Iverson. Chamberlain a screen. Iverson passes to Chamberlain. Anthony's checked in for New York. Frazier comes in for Richardson. Fourth team foul. Nick substitution. Carmelo Anthony. Walt Frazier. Pass to Chamberlain. Here's Irving. Shot clock at six. Elbow shot is on the way. Here's Malone, and Malone slams it home. And talk about putting some extra on it. That dunk was way over the top. Close game or not, he's going to finish firm when he gets the space. And they're bringing you up close and personal on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Now the pass to Reed. Outside Anthony. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Over to the wing. Reed kicks to Frazier. Passes to Houston. Shot clock at five. Shot's good by Anthony. Yeah, those are starting to add up, guys. Up there, last five baskets, three have been tripled. We've got 148 left to play here in the second quarter. Pass to Irving. 11 feet away. Here's Malone. And it's Malone finishing it off. I'll tell you, at his size, once he gets it in there, it's over. Now Frazier, six points for him. Ewing left side. Looking to end his cold spell. And then Ewing with the jam. There's no bigger play in a close game than a putback slam. Oh, and that one's got them all hyped up. Wow. They're bringing the energy, the hustle, the fight, and they also didn't give up on that possession. Here's Chamberlain. The Knicks making the shot. He dishes it to Mark. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. And Philadelphia making a change here. Collins has checked in. New York leading by four. Outside Anthony. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. Yeah, looking for offense inside as they try to chip away at this lead here in the second. 
On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. Cunningham, he's checked in for Irving. Free throw good from Anthony. The 76ers trail by seven. Iverson outside. Pass to Chamberlain. Back to Iverson. Happy to see that one going after missing six of his nine shots today. And that's what you like to see right there. A solid move to give himself some room and take it inside. Outside, Anthony. Ewing a screen on Cunningham. The pass to Frazier. Here's Houston. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. Next out front, leading by five. And we'll be back right after halftime for the start of the third quarter. We'll see you in a bit. And it's the 2K Halftime Show, Game 7, and the story so far is the quality start for the New York Knicks. Man, it's hard to imagine a hotter team from downtown. Better turn on that AC because those guys are cooking. Now, that could flip on them in a hurry, but I wouldn't put my money on it. Some outstanding shooters in that lineup. Taking a look at the situation for the Philadelphia 76ers. It all comes down to a decisive game seven. Guys, what's it gonna take for them to close out this series? You can't leave anything in the tank. Approach it like you're playing for your life because in some ways you are. And you can't get sloppy and waste a bunch of possessions. You gotta keep that focus. No question, let's get it. And that is it for halftime, folks. It is back to Kevin Harlan and the crew for the second half. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. And so it's Frazier who will bring it up for the New York Knicks. They've led by as many as 11 points. And New York looking at who they've got. Read out there with Anthony. Then there's Frazier. Then it's Ewing. And it's Houston. And the shooting guard. Al Barkley after the missed three by Carmelo. Iverson outside. Shoots over Ewing. And B, the pass to Barkley. Good ball movement here by the 76ers. Clock at four. From deep, Iverson. It's rebounded by New York. Reed's got his fifth rebound in this one. Ewing outside. Anthony right side. Over Irvin. And he tries off the glass, but it's no good. The 76ers trail by five. Barkley inside. Covered by Anthony. Barkley's shot is off. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Frazier kicks to Ewing. Shoots from the right block. And again, it's the Knicks missing. Ooh, they've come out of ice cold to start this half. Three misses and as many attempts. Iverson dishes to Irving. Iverson outside from deep. Oh, and he almost had a four-point play right there. He'll go to the line with a chance for three. That one on Frazier, and he's got his first free throw of the game. 
Allen Iverson. Great shot. And he's good on the first of three. That one misses. And he nails the third. Here is Frazier. Six points for him. Pass to Houston. Jacks up a three. Rebound by the 76ers. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. Pass to Chamberlain. Back to Iverson. To the middle. He's looking for Embiid and finds him. And that one, good. Embiid's got six. Looming large on the interior. Embiid, hard to deny. Pass to Houston. Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Ewing, the pass to Houston. Ewing outside. The three from Anthony. Rebound by Joel Embiid. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. It's stolen by Anthony. And a fast break now for the Knicks. Chamberlain with the block. And the quickness off the floor, the insane reach. Well, one of the greatest shot blockers you'll ever see. 76ers have attempted 11 free throws today and converted eight of them. it up and this next one could give them the lead and guys it's crazy he, he really was a late bloomer you know Irving didn't have the big time amateur career you hear about with some stars but boy he's more than made up for it and they now lead as the free throw drops for him Third quarter here, and three minutes have come off the clock. Anthony against Barkley. The pass to Houston. And here's Reed. The three from Anthony. Iverson grabs the board. Hasn't been able to dial it in from distance. He has just the one three, and that was in the first half. On the wing, Irving. Back to Iverson. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. He'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. One of the better scorers on the floor. Tough to defend him well without some contact. And AI fights through it this time. At the line for your Sixers, Allen Iverson. One shot. New York calls timeout. Yeah, just looking to tighten up their defense in the paint. They've got to be better. It's a matter of want to. Helping out contesting shots. You have to want to make the effort.
And so here is New York. Nothing yet for them in the third quarter. Passes it to Reed. Second half here. We're just over three and a half minutes into it. Shot to stop the run. Ewing can't get it to go. Philadelphia leading by four. Barkley outside. Pass to Iverson. Back to Barkley. Let's the three fly. It's rebounded by New York. It's amazing. All night he's been out of sync on the offensive end, yet they continue to lead. And stolen by Chamberlain. Inside, here's Embiid. And it's Reed pulling it down. Reed's got six rebounds now in the game. Frazier against Embiid. Drives to the hoop. A nice shot by Frazier. And giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive style. And that takes skill and the ability to make adjustments as you're going up. Now here's Iverson. He's got 12. Now, here is Chamberlain. Ball's knocked loose. Four on the clock. The three from Iverson. The 76ers with another miss. And so it's Anthony bringing it up for New York. Frazier left side. For the tie. Makes the bucket. Now he's got five field goals. Five for eight in the game. And look at how quick he was to bite on the pump fake. Left his feet way too soon. That's the Chamberlain. Embiid with it. Some nice ball movement here by the 76ers. And Iverson gets it to go. It's enough to where you have to respect him. Had one triple in the first half. Now has his second. Barkley against Anthony. There's the pick. Kicks it to Frazier. To the paint. Here's Ewing. No good on that one. Good D by Embiid. And now Philadelphia on the break. Barkley the pass to Chamberlain. Embiid with a screen on Ewing. And there's the foul. It'll go on Patrick Ewing. That's his third foul of the game. Sheik's checked in for Philadelphia. Monroe's checked in for New York. Iverson with the ball. 15 points in the game. And there's the pass to Embiid. Let's it go with a three. Ewing gets the rebound. Ewing's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. I don't know how many shots he's missed this quarter, but they're going to have to find offense from someone else. Iverson passes to Barkley. He feeds it to Chamberlain. Iverson outside. The basket good off the assist from Chamberlain. Iverson's got the lead up to six now for the 76ers. New York calls timeout. Yeah, let's see if Coach can get them back on the right track. Because right now, it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball.
Philadelphia on D. Just four points. That's all they've given up here in the second half. It's stolen by Barkley. Cheeks outside. Back to Barkley. And Barkley throws it down. And once he gets clear off the screen, there is no stopping him. <laughs> no, not when there's a flush waiting to happen. That's a big-time move and a big-time finish. Now here's Frazier. Ten points for him. Down low. Passes it to Reed. Six to shoot. He kicks to Frazier. To end the drought. Makes that one his sixth of the night. Shooting a very healthy six for nine. Philadelphia leading by five. Here's Iverson. Pass to Chamberlain. It's plucked, and that'll be Philadelphia as it goes on a bounce. 76ers retain possession. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. And this is postseason play at its finest, refusing to give up shots here in the playoffs. And Philadelphia making a change here. Just five to shoot. Here's Barkley, and Barkley throws it down hard. Using those sidelines to find an open guy and be always ready to deliver. Here's Monroe. Over Greer. Monroe, no good. And hard work on the glass. Once again, guys, they put a lot of effort and focus on the backboard. Cheeks the pass to Embiid. With the fadeaway. Rebound by Monroe. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. A nice shot by Frazier. Well, you like how aggressive he is making a play at the rim against Flint. And let's forget the height disadvantage. He brings the effort and he brings the energy. Embiid the screen. Cheeks kicks to Barkley. Cheeks against Frazier. Cheeks the pass to Embiid, and Embiid throws it down. What a scary sight. Joel Embiid with all that momentum taking it to the hoop, looking like a freight train. Now here's Anthony. 12 points for him. It's hauled in by the 76ers. Barkley's got his fourth rebound in this one. Hard to catch up when you can't hit shots. This is a quarter he liked to forget. Al Chamberlain, he's got eight. Cheeks outside. Here's Embiid. Robust move inside by Joel Embiid. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Anthony against Barkley. Let's a floater go. Count it. And the 76ers lead has been cut back down to seven. The bucket there from Anthony. Oh, the delicate touch on display. Anthony showing he can beat you with the floater as well. Now here's MB. Ten points for him. Back to Cheeks. MB the screen. Nifty move. Ewing sends it back. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Ewing. A different look for New York. The busher comes in for Ewing. And King subbed in for Anthony. Here's Greer. Two on the clock. And it's in there. Greer's got the lead up to nine now for Philadelphia. And of all the attributes, one thing that sometimes gets overlooked with Chamberlain is the court vision. Makes a great read there. Now, here is Reed. Frazier the pass to King. Here's Monroe. And the rejection by Embiid. A 
Good job by him on the glass here tonight. Plus eight in that department. Got a hand on it. And he lobs it up toward the rim. And the dunk by Reed. Oh, you got to love his aggressiveness to finish inside. Well, his leaping ability gives him a great advantage. Now, here's Chiefs. Embiid with a screen on Frazier. Pass to Greer. Doesn't go for him. Good work defensively by Monroe. Two seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. from way outside and no good in the last second attempt this time and so it's Philadelphia bringing the quarter to a close with a seven point lead they're playing a bruising game inside and it's working for them back to the action in just a minute And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. NBA playoff round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. We've got Moses Malone. Cunningham is out there with Collins, and it's Greer in at the point. That's the group in the game for the 76ers. Here's Shanks. They set the pick, launches it. Rebound by Monroe. Monroe's got four rebounds in this game. There's the pass to DeBusher. Ewing surveying the floor from the arc. That's good. The Philadelphia lead is cut down to four on the bucket from Houston. Gotta love seeing Houston get space there to shoot it from deep. He is one of the best from beyond the arc. Passes it to Malone. A runner. It's rebounded by New York. It's Monroe high post over Greer. Shays with the rebound. Well, he wants to shoot his way out of this cold spell, but the struggles continue. You know, to me, this is when you want to focus on creating for others. Give someone else a chance. It's called a teammate. Cunningham passes to Malone, and he makes that one. So reliable. They've really leaned on him at the offensive end. Next trail by six. Monroe with a bounce pass. Oh, he's going up for the alley-oop here. And they are really racking up the assists in this one. And their team chemistry is evident. These guys enjoy playing with one another. They get a hand on it. Stolen by Ewing. Monroe outside. Kicks it to Ewing. Pass to King. Back to DeBusher. New York moving the ball around. Five to shoot. Pass to Houston. Puts up a deep three. It's Cunningham with the rebound. And he's a good shooter from outside, but not sure from that deep. You know, we're seeing players move further and further back to create space. But that does make it a tougher shot. Now here's Monroe following the miss by Moses Malone to the middle. Here's Houston. 
Good, and it's Ewing with the assist that time. Ewing's got four assists now tonight. And that's right in his wheelhouse. Looking to make an impact when it counts. It's the fourth quarter and it's a close game. You want to get the ball to someone you can rely on. Here's Greer for the three. He can't hit that time. So frustrating when you can't get anything to go down as you're trying to help your team finish the job. Here's King. And the Knicks getting another bucket right there. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Here's Greer, covered by Monroe. Shays can't hit. And so it's Monroe with it, bringing it up for the New York Knicks. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. And hey guys, it's really amazing the effect Busher has on this team, especially on the defensive end. He's smart, he's cagey, and incredibly tough. Three shots. Three shots. And the free throw is good, now leading by one. And, and no matter what, one of the big positives they can take away from this game is how well they perform at the line. He's off on the second. Nails the third. Well, they should be looking at a three-point lead. Hopefully for them, that miss won't cost them. And Philadelphia calls time here. And Coach can't like what he's seeing, trying to get them refocused. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. making a change here. Stoudemire's checked in. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Well, during that last break, I heard Philadelphia's coach as he addressed the team. Now, they preached the little things in the huddle. They asked their team to battle on those 50-50 balls. One extra possession could be all the difference. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. Quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by. Next foul, Ricky Garrett. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. <laughs> On the wing, Irving. The floater, 
and the layup is up and in. Irving's got it all tied up now for the 76ers. That's nice work. Stopping short of the rim. Just laying it over the top. And here's Anthony for three. And again, it's the Knicks missing. Trying to shoot himself out of his slump. And it's not going well. And a wide open look for Irving. Offline from the top of the key. Here's Garen and the pass to Ewing. Anthony left side. Here's Garen. Just five on the clock. And it's good with time running down on the shot clock. Garen's got his first bucket in this one. Now the 76ers with it. Passes to Barton. Iverson outside. It's blocked. Here's Houston, covered by Irving. Here's Anthony. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That's his second. Takes more than a foul to scare off Carmelo Anthony. He still puts up a shot. And let's get your guys' take now on the hustle stats for the Knicks. What I love and the coaching staff has to love is the defense. They've really brought the energy with all these blocks we've seen in this one. Another thing they're doing well tonight is getting steals, and that can be attributed to their tenacious style defensively. And the first one drops. Embiid, he's checked in for the 76ers. Jones comes in for Cunningham, and New York making a change here. So Anthony nails both of them. The 76ers trail by four. Iverson outside for three. Carmelo Anthony comes up with the rebound. Out to Stoudemire. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to Anthony. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Draws the contact on a pump fake. The deep is over-aggressive, and it's mellow time. Carmelo Anthony. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. So Anthony nails both of them. The 76ers trail by six. Here's Iverson. That shot off the mark. Nice D from Frazier. And it's Frazier with the ball for the New York Knicks. Here in the fourth, they've allowed just four points. Up top, Reed. Defended by Jones. Six on the shot clock. And there's the call on Jones. That is his first foul of the game. And the 76ers making a change here. Chamberlain's checked in. And New York with a change here, too. Ewing's checked in. Pass to Reed. Now Frazier. 
And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That's on Allen Iverson. And one of the very best in our league at getting to the line. Walt Frazier just has that great change of pace and aggressive nature. Always playing, though, under control. Shoot two. First free throw is good. And so he makes both from the line. The 76ers trail by eight. Here is Iverson. He kicks it to Irving. Will it go? That's good. Great play is set up by Iverson. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Anthony, the pass to Ewing. Good D by Embiid. Now the 76ers with it. Now the pass to Iverson. It's stolen by Frazier. Puts one up from 19. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That one's on Anthony. No, I'll tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. At the line for your Sixers, Allen Iverson. Two shots. First one falls for. <laughs> they are making it look easy at the free throw line here in the second half. And both free throws good for Iverson. See, now he's getting defenders back on their heels a little bit. Getting to the foul line here in the second half. New York calls timeout. And as fans and broadcasters, we're not permitted to hear the specifics in these huddles. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. All right, fans, let's make the noise for the food shop and show clock and sectors. Seventy Sixers on defense, trailing by four. Reed kicks to Frazier. Some nice passing by New York here, and Anthony gets double teamed. 
Frazier outside. Shot clock at six. Shot from the wing. Tries again. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. That one on MB. Team is already in the penalty. Shooting for New York. Willis Green. At the line for two. Shoot two. Free throw good from Reed. Good on both. Now here's Iverson. to Chamberlain and here's MB Ewing defending fades and shoots that one's in there the New York leaders cut down to four on the bucket from MB after a lackluster first half he's taken charge offensively we'll see how the defense responds Frazier the pass to Ewing now here is Reed and stolen by Iverson and they're on the break Reed with the steal and the tuck by Reed. He takes advantage of them in every way possible. And Greg, he lures them into a trap on the steal, and then bang, straight to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. And so here is Philadelphia, following the score by New York. Here's Embiid, and Ewing sends it back. And that's out of bounds. Philadelphia will retain possession. Here's Barkley. Hits it despite the hand. Great strong finish. And he'll go to the line for one more. That one's on Anthony. That's his second personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for your Sixers. Barkley. One shot. And that one falls for Barkley. And the Knicks with possession here. They've led by as many as 11 points. Outside Anthony. Back to Reed. Outside Anthony. Pass to Reed. Outside Anthony. Just five to shoot. New York needs to get off a shot. Chamberlain with the block. Iverson with the ball. Driving in. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. And the speed of Iverson is so difficult to keep up with. When he's driving, you sometimes force the foul. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. And both free throws good for Iverson. And so it's Frazier who will bring it up for the New York Knicks. They lead by one. Here's Anthony. The kick out to Frazier. 
Embiid against Hewitt. Looking to get it going, and the layup is good. And the Knicks lead by three. And how about the muscle inside from Ewing? Easily getting to wherever he wants to on that low block. Embiid, the pass to Iverson. Embiid with a screen on Frazier. Iverson out to Barkley to tie it up. That's good. Great play is set up by Iverson. Iverson's got assist number five here tonight. And the Knicks with possession here. Takes a step back. Anthony down low. Barkley on him. Houston can't get it to go. And they're in position to take the lead. And how big would a bucket be at this stage of the game? Irving kicks to Chamberlain. Irving passes to Iverson. Lock at six. Shoots over Frazier. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Houston, the pass to Anthony. One thirty-two left in the fourth. From the baseline. Good as the jump shot falls. Anthony's got six points in the quarter. I, I mean, who else do you want taking this shot? Anthony, a natural scorer in any situation. Stolen by Ewing. And a fast break now for New York. And how about no hesitation? Now Houston there just kept his cool and knocks down a huge shot. Iverson outside. Embiid with a screen on Frazier from 18 feet away. And on that shot, with that, the Nick lead is put down now to just two points with that basket from Embiid. And in the big moment, Embiid is your guy. He's always ready to go on the attack. Now here's Anthony. And stolen by Chamberlain. Right side, Irving. Pass to Embiid. Shoots over Ewing. Shooting foul. As the whistle blows, he'll shoot two free throws. That's his fourth personal foul. It's on Patrick Ewing. And, and most bigs you want to see at the foul line. However, Embiid is not one of them. So the first one drops, and that narrows the gap to one. And MB drops them both. No doubt about those free throws. This is why you put the ball in his hands. New York calls timeout. It's tied at 99. 44 seconds left in the fourth quarter.
44 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Pops it up for Anthony. Count it. How many times have we seen that throughout his career? Mello with a clutch bucket. And Philadelphia calls time here. They trail by two. There's 39 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Guys, your thoughts? Hey, they do have enough time here if they shoot quickly to get the two for one. We'll see if they try. Nine seconds left in the fourth quarter. Allen Iverson on the way. Frazier covering. He just doesn't look like himself this quarter. Something's missing. And it also shows you how difficult this game is. He's just a little bit off, but it can result in missing everything. Now here's Anthony after the miss from Allen Iverson. Five on the clock. Fires the three. Places one from three. They're in total command of this game with time starting to run out. Reason why they've tightened up the vice grip a little more each time up the floor. We'll see if they can close this one out. Timeout called the 76ers. They're down by five. Six seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Iverson.
takes the three. No good there. And they do it. They'll move on to round two. Thrilling fashion, guys, taking round one in what certainly will go down. Guys, it's one of the most competitive series this year. And, and you always love a game set and, and no disappointment here. And, and these guys are ready and excited for round two. Maybe a bit tired, but the adrenaline is still pumping. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Steve Smith, Craig Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. As New Balance presents our player of the game, Patrick Ewing.